it is expected that 6 out of 10 people will go out to eat at least once per week. Our first question is, out of every 10 people, how many would be expected to eat out at least once per week? And we're told 6 out of 10 people will go out to eat at least once per week, and therefore out of every 10, we expect 6 people to go out to eat at least once per week. Our next question is, out of every 10 people, how many would be expected to not eat out at least once per week? Well, if 6 out of 10 do go out to eat at least once per week, then 10 minus 6 or 4 people would be expected to not go out to eat at least once per week. So this answer is 4 people. Now these next two questions deal with odds, where the odds in favor of an event equals the ratio of the number of favorable outcomes to the number of unfavorable outcomes, and the odds against an event is equal to the ratio of the number of unfavorable outcomes to the number of favorable outcomes. So our next question is, what are the odds in favor of a person eating out at least once per week? So this is going to be the ratio of the number of people that would eat out at least once per week to the number of people that would not eat out at least once per week. So the ratio would be 6 to 4, and we can express a ratio three ways. We can express it in fraction form using a colon, as we see here, and also using the word 2. But let's first start it as a fraction, because ratios should be expressed in simplest form, similar to how we simplify fractions. Because 6 and 4 share a common factor of 2, we can divide 6 by 2 and 4 by 2 to get a simplified ratio and simplify the odds. So the simplify odds would be 3 to 2 in fraction form, or using a colon 3 to 2, or using words 3 to 2. The odds can be expressed in any of these three ways. And for our last question, we're asked what are the odds against a person eating out at least once per week? So this would be the ratio of the number of people that don't eat out at least once per week to the number of people that do eat out at least once per week. So this ratio would be 4 to 6, which does simplify. So the simplified ratio is 2 to 3 as a fraction using a colon or using the word 2. So the main thing to remember is that when we're talking about odds, we're comparing either favorable to unfavorable or unfavorable to favorable. And remember, when we're talking about probability, we compare the favorable number of outcomes to the total number of outcomes. So this question doesn't ask, but the probability that a person will eat out at least once per week, let's call it probability of E, would be equal to 6 divided by 10 the total number of outcomes, which is a fraction that simplifies to 3 fifths, which can also be expressed as a decimal as 0 0.6, or as a percentage as 60%. So it is important to know the difference between probability and odds. I hope you found this helpful.